If you need coins on Mad Mobile or Madden Console, you have to go to my sponsor, InstantMaddenCoins.com. Right now, all Madden Mobile purchases will be doubled, and my code MMG is 10% off. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. First, gotta apologize, my voice is super gone. U of M, MSU, MSU somehow beat U of M, so my voice is really gone, as you can imagine. It's cool, it's not like U of M was number seven ranked in the country and we were unranked. I don't, you know, I don't even worry about it, it's whatever. <sighs> mm. Mm. Wolverines are trash. So I usually don't do reaction videos, so you have to imagine that this video is gonna be pretty insane. I was scrolling YouTube and up in my like trending or suggested popped a video called, hold up, and I have to give, I have to give credit. From Sharp Life, his his YouTube channel is called Sharp Life. He's got 25,000 subscribers right now. I think that number is definitely gonna be going up because I really like his content. Titled the hardest hitting high school football player I've ever seen, Fotu Leatow. Now the kid looks like an animal. I haven't watched his highlights yet because I wanted this reaction video to be like completely untouched. But Sharp Life, thanks for uh, introducing me to this guy. I remember the days of huddle highlights. Cause I used to have a huddle highlight tape, but it was me kicking, okay? It was not nearly as cool as this freaking apparently godly linebacker. The kid has like an offer to Alabama, MSU, LSU. He looks like Troy Palomalu. He looks like he could definitely murder somebody. The other thing is this kid is younger than me, bro. He's class of 2015, so he's probably like 17 or 18 years old right now. I don't know what drugs they're feeding kids, but I did not get any of those drugs, okay? I may be six foot five, 225 pounds of raw muscle, but I'm not this. I'm like 5'10", if we're being honest, guys. So I haven't watched the highlights yet. The hardest hitting player in high school football. Let's see. All right, we got a kickoff. Maybe he was like a return man too. He's not, he's literally not even looking for a lane to block. He is just looking to murder people. Hold up. That is so savage. He looks like he's, I thought he was gonna return the kick. Is there even a purpose to this though? Like is he really, is he really laying a good block there? Is he just trying to kill somebody? Oh my God. That is terrifying, dude. Holy oh, oh, he needs some milk. His body didn't even move. Dear, oh God. Dude, is he just like a kill man on kickoff? This is so savage. Oh God, oh God. Ah! See, okay, now that's good. Nobody does this on onside kicks. On onside kicks, people usually think that everyone's supposed to sprint for the ball. What you want is a kid like this dude who will go first, literally murder the first person you see, and then you just have a wall of your teammates go get the ball. So all those front two, those front two guys who would be recovering this onside kick, you just hit them so hard that they're not gonna be able to get the ball and then everybody else gets it. So I actually like this play. To be totally honest, I kind of just feel like he's just this athletic monster and he's just going to hit people. Cause it doesn't seem like he has a perp. Oh God. Okay, here we go. Okay, okay. He's got a punt return. I want to see this. I don't like how he's holding the ball. He's holding it like this. Oh wow, he just doesn't give a f dude. He's gonna take that to the house? Wow, dude. Holy f Oh God. I don't even, nobody's gonna even touch him on this play. I'd be surprised if somebody touched him on this play. No, no, they're not gonna do. They're not gonna, <gasps> did he touch him? Was I wrong? I don't know if that guy touched him at the ankles. Holy crap, dude. All right, here we go, an actual defensive linebacker play. Cause I assume- ah! Got him! I assume in college you'll play linebacker. That's, I don't think he'd be a return man. Wow. Here's the funny thing about gauging football highlights though, especially in high school. Go watch JJ Watts high school highlights, dude. He looks like a bum. He seriously looks like a bum. And I know JJ Watt developed a lot later in his career, uh, cause I'm pretty sure he went to Central Michigan University for his first year and then he got really good. And then he went over to Wisconsin or Ohio State. Don't remember which one, but I know he went to like a, an okay school in Michigan to start. But like, this guy's high school highlights are stupid good. And he's gonna be a freak of nature in college, but then you never even know if that's gonna translate to NFL. I'm not saying anything bad, to be honest. This guy is a freaking animal. I'm just saying like, it's crazy when you think about JJ Watt having this like, bummy highlight tape and this guy just murdering every, this is 12 minutes of this. I've seen two minutes and 30 seconds, whatever. You, I think you get my point, let's, let's move on. 
How excited are you though if you're a coach? If you have this kid on your team and you're a coach, wow. I'm willing to bet he wrestles too. That was, that was some wrestling form tackle right there. I would not be surprised if this kid's a wrestler. Do not tell me he's gonna take this to the house. There is literally like eight people there. Holy shit, dude. No, if he takes this to the touchdown, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> oh, okay, it wasn't a touchdown. I was about to say, I was gonna have to cry. That was insane though, he hurdled somebody. He's gonna, oh God. Fumbles the snap, his j Spin cycle, hold up, please. I have to watch that again. Instant replay. Instant replay button. Watch this spin cycle. You have to watch this spin cycle. I know you guys already saw it, but wait for it, wait for it, bang. That's beautiful. I did that once in seventh grade. Does that count? Dude, look at that. Look at that gap pressure. If I'm a coach, I'm literally saying FOTU. If that's how you say it, FOTU, literally blitz every play. Like, don't do anything else but sprint after people. <laughs> this guy's such a beast. When I was in high school, and if you guys play high school football, you know what I'm talking about too. You know how there's always like a team that's got like a pretty good player, and like you're kind of like, you're, you, you, you do a scouting report around him in, in, in practice. We had a guy who was a really good quarterback, a really like mobile quarterback. So we had to like game plan, like making sure you get some edge pressure and making sure you go quarterback contained, stuff like that. Imagine scouting reports against this kid. Like, what do you even do? He's gonna murder you. Okay, the other thing though, is I don't understand how this kid ever gets punt returns or kick returns. And my point for that is how do you kick the ball to him? If that guy is back there on, on kick return, I'm either kicking the ball way the hell away from him, or I'm literally kicking it out of bounds or squibbing it. I don't understand how this a punt or a kick ever lands in this guy's hand. Cause you are not doing your job. He's gonna, this guy's a beast. I would never put the ball in this guy's hands. But then like when he does wildcat, what do you even do? Just run commit? Assume he's, well you have to assume he's not gonna pass. I haven't seen him pass yet. Yeah, dude, he just literally snaps it. That's literally the QB sneak in Madden. That's when you audible the QB sneak in Madden and you have all verticals and then you just run right up the middle. Except this guy turns it into a touchdown. All right, so only thing I wanna say, he's from, so it's Stella Coom High School in Stella Coom, Washington. Probably didn't say that right. Does anybody know what division this high school is? This doesn't feel like division one high school football to me. I feel like his opponents are really shitty, is I guess what I'm trying to say. Not taking anything away from him. This kid would be a god in division one football too, but I don't know why, I just feel like these opponents are bad. I feel like they're not very good. But at the same time, he could just be on such a godly team that it just, they just look bad. Wait, just <laughs> Look at this dude. Bruh. Look at this dude. He thought he was really gonna make that tackle, bro. If I'm this kid and Fotu Leotel is lead blocking for this guy, I'm literally stopping. I'm literally stopping going, I'm not gonna make this tackle. I'm gonna conserve my energy for the next play. What do you think is gonna happen here? He fucking, he showboated. He literally showboated early. Holy shit, that guy was doing the Brady. He was doing the Brady sit down. You know that meme where Brady's sitting down like really depressed? That is exactly what this kid's doing. Well, he's still sitting there. He's still sitting there. I love it. Uh-oh. 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 Please don't pick that ball up. Oh my God. I feared for that man's life right there. I really did. But he lived, so I'm happy. Oh, it's no way. Oh, gun he's <laughs> gunner on. Oh, oh my God. Bro, he's the gunner on punt, and he ran over. Yo, that is so sad. Okay, the funny thing about this is, is did he really save any time? That's what I love about this play. Like, had he just ran around this guy, because he's clearly faster than him, do you think it would've been faster to run around him, or just to run straight through him? Because he ran straight through him. That's f***ed up, dude. This guy's a savage. 930,000 views. This high school kid's highlight tape has almost more views than my most viewed video ever. And I've made like 700 videos. All right, that's enough of this, guys. Keep me updated. I'm not super good at staying updated on like recruiting stuff. So if you guys know where this kid's gonna go in college, let me know, cause I wanna watch. Like I kinda wanna see this kid play in college. 
I'm not sure if he's already committed or how old this video highlight is or any of that stuff, but I'd love to hear it. That's it for now, guys. So thanks for watching. As always, if you like this video, let me know and let me know any other recruits that I might actually like make a video on because this was cool. I liked watching this. That's it for now, guys. Thanks for watching. As always, take care.